it is special in the way that it has developed into a lifetime achievement award. So we are looking back at what are the outstanding mathematicians in, have accomplished throughout their career. Uh, and there are these stellar names that we all learned about when we went to grad school, and now they get recognition. I mean, first of all, there is uh, one fact that one has to get uh, clear here. There is no shortage of candidates. There are plenty of excellent candidates. And the second fact is that there is no absolute ranking of them. So it's not just to tick off the top one on the list. So this means that we rely on the community to uh, give us advice on whom we should choose and to compare and, and uh, rank and describe their work so that we have something that we can discuss in the committee. In principle, the answer is yes. The statutes do not prevent us from doing that. However, the tradition has now been that it's given for a lifetime achievement, which means that we are looking at mathematicians at the end of their career rather than at the beginning of their career. But if a young mathematician suddenly solves one of the big unsolved problems, like the Millennium Problems, he or she can certainly get the Abel Prize. Yeah, because for many of us, it will be outside our comfort zone, the area that we have been working on. So we learn about other mathematicians' work, uh, the activity in other fields, and uh, that's always uh, very interesting. Yeah, I, there's a lot of unpaid work in uh, academics, so it's, uh, that is not uh, so special. But I think people feel the commitment and they like to recognize the best mathematicians uh, worldwide. So they, they like the work and they, it's of course a recognition to be selected as a member of the committee. I don't know if there is any nicest thing about it. It's, uh, it's a lot of responsibility. It's uh, a lot of hard work. The nicest thing, uh, I think, is to discuss with the members in the committee because we have a very good atmosphere. It's, uh, people are friendly, we are learning a lot, we're exchanging points of view, and our points of view develop during the process. So it's always very interesting. Mm. It depends on uh, how you measure it. In recognition, I think it is recognized as one of the leading uh, prizes in mathematics worldwide, maybe the leading one. I think hopefully it will um, continue to recognize outstanding mathematics uh, worldwide. I hope it will uh, spread out over more fields. We will get uh, recipients from all over the world uh, representing a more diverse uh, field of mathematicians. And I also hope that the monetary award will increase. It is important because it recognizes outstanding work in mathematics and it tells hopefully to the public that uh, mathematics is important for science and for, for the society at large.